Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. My name is Dr. Thorsten Bakschik and I'm the CEO of SRH Berlin University of Applied Sciences. You may have seen that our university is facing attacks on social media from a former student, especially on YouTube. The statements she's making about us are factually inaccurate and in many respects her words are misleading and are doing damage to our university, our students and our staff. In this video I will tell you our side of the story. I hope to shed some light on why this former student's claims do not correspond to reality. I will also explain a little more about why she's doing this. Please watch until the end as it will be very easy to see why this former student sees reasons to turn against us. Like most higher education organizations, we place a lot of emphasis on maintaining our academic standards. We do this to ensure the value of the degrees we award to the students at our university. In rare cases, a student may fail to adhere to basic academic standards. We understand that everybody might make a mistake. That is why we are always happy to guide the, our students in the right direction and advise them on the do's and don'ts. If, however, academically unacceptable behavior continues, we have to issue warnings and with repeated violations, we are sometimes left with no choice but to initiate exmatriculation procedures. In the case of the former student I am talking about today, significant violations of academic standards have occurred even after appropriate urgent warnings from our side. After careful and thorough examination of the facts, the academic committee had no choice but to move to exmatriculation, expelling her from continuing her studies at our university. We are very aware that this must have been a very sobering and bitter experience for the former student. However, we believe that the exmatriculation, which resulted from her own actions, does not entitle her to damage our university and its reputation by using false allegations. What we find even more unacceptable and unethical is that this person has offered us to remove any negative statements about our university in exchange for a university diploma and the reimbursement of her tuition fees. In our opinion, this stands in stark contrast to the sentiment she's conveying, claiming that her campaign is merely meant to inform others. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video. I hope that I've been able to provide you with some much needed context. And if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. Contact information is posted below. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.